What's up guys, welcome to my channel, this is Are We Kupu Now, and today we're going to talk about an incident that happened last night. So, we're not going to be really comedic today, we're just going to talk about just me and my thoughts about what happened last night and how people are going about it. If you haven't heard by now, there was um, a shooting that occurred last night, uh, I think it was by two or three people who are very trained. Um, uh, snipers and uh, someone with an assault rifle. Two uh, African Americans who were unjustly murdered, uh, killed for um, reasons they should have not been killed for. Do want to state that they both had guns, but they were also licensed to carry, which is our Second Amendment and our right as Americans to bear arms. I think what happened here was that they saw them as blacks with guns and they automatically got afraid and just shot without thinking. It's crazy. It's, it's, it's crazy. When you see the video, it's, uh, I'm not going to lie, I was on the verge of tears because it's, it's, a, it's a scary thing. It is a scary thing because you, when you see someone dying, you, could, you forget everything else. You, you see what being a human is like again. And, you know, I think we're losing sense of that. You know, when, when it's a white person, they say he's mentally ill, he was a good student, and he just snapped. And then when it's Arab or Muslim, don't, they don't even think twice. Terrorist, right away, straight away, terrorist. I believe Micah Johnson was a terrorist. It's kind of sad that there's people on Twitter who are trying to link him to the Nation of Islam and calling him Micah X Johnson so they could try to remind people of Malcolm X. People are like, oh no, it wasn't, uh, it wasn't towards civilians, so it doesn't count as a terrorist attack. And people don't think he's a terrorist. That's amazing. On my Twitter, they're like, he's not a terrorist. He's not a Muslim, therefore he's not a terrorist. I'm, I'm sorry for this really sad, melancholic video, but um, it is what it is. I just wanted to talk about it, uh, and I truly, truly wanted to bring up the fact that I believe this man is a terrorist. He is a terrorist, and I would love it if you guys could hashtag Micah Johnson is a terrorist because I am waiting for the media to call him a terrorist because he is a terrorist. Just because he didn't have a Muslim ideology behind him, just because he didn't have a religious ideology behind him, does not mean he is not a terrorist, okay? He killed innocent people for a political gain, for an ideology that he's created for his own. So, I would hope you guys hashtag that and uh, be safe. And I do not condone any acts of violence. I say this again because I know a lot of you young people out there are claiming he's a hero, but he is not, guys. I can guarantee you there are going to be more lives taken because uh, this has fueled people and has made them more angry. And if it makes any difference, I, I urge you guys to please don't go towards any violent acts. Try to not be extreme and use your mouth. You can do a lot with the words you say and you can be a true hero that way. But I do support the African Americans and NYPD uh, and law enforcement uh, around the country that support doing things the right way. Uh, and let's not forget that, guys, because it is very important that we be fair on all sides and every human life counts and is very valuable, all right? So uh, with that said, hashtag Micah Johnson is a terrorist. We are gonna get the media to say that because he is a terrorist and he terrorized all of us and he also terrorized a whole bunch of cops and uh, he tried to gain a political mean by the murders that he committed. So thank you guys so much for watching. Peace, love, and unity, and I'll see you, though, later.